Our kids, our students need 21st century skills for 21st century jobs. 70% of all the jobs that are being created today require at least two years of college or significant technical training. How do we expose young people to this incredible opportunity of what we all call STEM and show them that the upside that's out there in the global economy right now is the sciences. It's in technology, engineering, and math. What's exciting is Jacksonville, Florida is tapping into all the different parts of the economy, businesses, not-for-profits, universities. People are pulling together to motivate much younger people to get involved. My name is Mark McCombs. I'm the executive director and founder of Renaissance Jax Inc., a local nonprofit dedicated to bringing an international robotics competition platform known as FIRST to full ubiquity in Northeast Florida. It's all about building a robot that autonomously competes on a four foot by eight foot game field, but behind the scenes, they're doing a research project presentation. They have a teamwork challenge that we call core values, and the core values are so important. It's what's guiding each team through their season. I support Renaissance Jacks. I think Mark McCombs is a great asset for our community. He's visionary. I think the data says that if you go through the first Lego League program, you're seven times more likely to become an engineer. I thought that if you continue to go forward, you would have pushed that closed. Check, check it out in your next run. I'm Brady Merkel, head coach of Team Neon Supernova. We're the Northeast Florida regional champions from uh, the 2015-2016 year. The first Lego League is really a holistic program to give the kids an opportunity to excel in a place they haven't been able to excel, which is using their mind and designing and engineering. It's pretty fun because we get to learn from our previous mistakes and then we can build upon them and try to get higher than what we could do last year. The best part of robot is every single time you run the robot, it's frustration. That one moment when everything works perfectly at competition, that one moment when you've got all the points you can get is the best feeling. Three, two, one! The energy here is really something. I, I would recommend that anybody who has never been to a robotics competition come to one. You'll be energized and you'll feel better about the future of America. Whether it's Lego and robotics, whether it's science and engineering, you show them the way early on to put their hands on something. By the time they get through high school and make their way to college, they're world class in the world of the STEM fields. Jacksonville as a community is really saying it loud right now. We are saying loud and clear, we are going to build the future here in Jacksonville.